I got the Samsung Admire right here. Now, if y'all familiar with SPB Shell, you know that it is a 3D launcher, a high quality 3D launcher at that. But I could not believe that it actually runs smooth on this phone. Now, as you may know, this phone is a 800 megahertz. It got a 800 megahertz processor and it got 512 megabytes of RAM. Now, SPB shell running on here, I didn't even think it was possible, but I just installed it because I was bored. But I could show you how to get the shit for free because this shit costs like, like fucking $15 on, on the Play Store, I think. Um, but yeah, I got this shit for free. Look at this shit. SPB shell on the motherfucking Samsung and Meyer. With no lag. That's crazy. No lag. This is a nice round. I mean, <clears throat> this is a nice launcher. It's running smooth. I mean, I can't even believe it. That's crazy. Look at this shit. This shit really runs smooth as fuck. No lag issues. Um, but I can show you how to get this shit for free. All you gotta do. Oh, I'm gonna put the link in the description. But you gonna need um, Lucky Patcher. You gonna need a, this app called Lucky Patcher, and you gonna need the um, the fucking uh, shit. I don't know what I'm trying to say. SPB shell. You gonna need SPB shell. But I'm gonna show you where to get it from. Uh, first of all, is you gonna go to the computer, or you can go on your phone. It really don't matter. But you go to foreshare.com go to foreshare now when you search you gotta look type in spb shell 3d but remember this you gotta get version 1.5.3 you gotta get that one no other ones is going to work with Lucky Patcher. You got to get 1.5.3. You search for it and you download. Anyone that says 1.5.3, you can download it. Make sure you download that. You know. And the link for Lucky Patcher, I'm going to put that in the description. But you download Lucky Patcher or not. Once you got those apps on your phone, when you download SPB, you do not open the app. Do not open it after it installs. You go to the phone. You go to Lucky Patcher. Now when it load up, you're gonna see SPB shell right here. Now you when you click on it, you click open menu of patches and after you do that you click on remove license verification now if you got any other version than 1.5.3 of SPB shell then you will not be able to remove the license verification and you won't be able to use the launcher so when you click that you click auto mode You gotta wait. Now, when it's done, it's gonna say successful for just that top one. And all of these are gonna be failed, but, and it's gonna say you had 13% of luck. Now, I know that's a small percentage, but all you do is click OK and exit out. SPB shell is loading. Man, it's 
to load right up without asking you to put in any kind of serial number. So yeah, it worked. Like I said, you gotta download 1.3, I mean 1.5.3 version of SPB shell. Or no other versions is gonna work. And this never fails. It's flawless. No lag. I love the 3D widgets. Now if you click menu and add, you will see SPB widget. That's the list of all the 3D widgets that come with SPB shell. So yeah, like, comment, subscribe to my channel. I'm out.